Welcome back to The Witcher 3 Wild Hunt Part 30. I am pretty sure we're on now, guys. So, it's been a little while. I've uh, I've had a little bit of time off, but I'm trying to skip... Uh, I'm trying to skip... I'm trying to stick to the new schedule. So, um, yeah. I'm recording today, and I'm going to try and get the part out by tomorrow, which is a, a bit of a task. But if I record early, I edit early, and I upload early, then you know what? It should be out, and it should be fine. I mean, it'll blow early, meaning overnight, but I have to get it's everything else up before then. But yes, it'll be awesome. I'm really looking forward to playing today, guys. We have quite a lot of quests to do, like, um, sort of second ones. You know, we have, obviously, Family Blade. We got the Possession, which is a uh, main one, kind of. We have Gwen, so we have to go and do that. We got the Lord of Unvik, so that's a, bit, that's a big one, too. We have Iron Maiden. We have Cave of Dreams. Uh, we can't do that one yet. Obviously, following the thread, we got a... I well, know, I guess we can't do that yet, either. Um, we still can't do that one, because we have to go back to Novigrad. But there's a lot of, like, there's a lot of stuff here, you know what I mean? Like, a lot of these are Novigrad, but we also have, obviously, main quests here, such as Echoes of the Past. So, I thought I'd start with Family Blade, because I had a marker really close to it, and, yeah, we'll go from there. I know I missed a couple things last time. Um, it was, it was, hang on. Jesus Christ, okay, hang on, it's, it's a little bit loud, let me turn it down to 50. Hang on. So no. Yeah, that's the plan today. I'm gonna do some more quests. I'm gonna try and get through it, you know? What the f- Oh yeah, my sword has, um, has a rune on it, right? Just in case. Oh! Maybe I should have put the uh, poison on both. Oh, hang on. Behold, that is a seal for winter. Yeah. Okay, I'm reading. Okay, with a maw that reeks like a cesspit, but your head, brilliant, making a mold of the key with a lump of clay. Damn clever. Can't believe I didn't think of it myself. Oh, myself. I strolled right into the armory after dark. Kuliu was lying there, right where you said, in a case wrapped in oil cloth. Wrapped in oil cloth. What a blade fits your hand like a toothstone. So, sorry, what the hell is this? Fits your hand like a toothstone lasses tit. Okay, tit. Point sharp as a needle hit set with gems. Stared so hard I didn't hear that fool Olaf coming. He would have caught me. He would. He would had. Sorry, he would have caught me had he not tripped up, tripped and smacked his gob on into the ground. Seems the gods are looking after us. So now you've got to sell the blade. That won't be easy. Not many got that kind of coin. And them who don't want to cross, and them who don't want to cross crock. Luckily, my brother Yurjin, wait, how do you say that? Is like, is like, Yurjin knows a merchant named Gimna, Gimna, who also finds willing buyers for second-hand goods. They're going to meet in the old fortress near Fiersdal, Fiersdal, uh, Fier. Fiaz, Fiazdal, I don't know. Maybe they'll make a deal with Lugos. He's got heaps of gold and not a drop of fear of Arn Crate. Cheers to you, old goat. Svinia. Okay, well, we, um, I, I fucking... I, uh, I limped my way through that one, but we, we did it. Okay, we did the quest. We killed everybody here. Well, no, we haven't done the quest. We've, um, we've sort of, you know, we've... We killed a bunch of guys, and <laughs> we know where to go. So, um, I guess we're going back to Lugos. That's what, that's what I'm getting the impression of here. We'll see. One thing I'd like to do... Hang on, it depends. Where, where, is it actually right back to Lugos? Oh, uh, it, is, it is in a weird place. What I'm going to do is I'm going to, um... I'm going to go back to the, uh, Kertrolder, because I realized that I forgot last time, this is another thing I forgot, to go and, um, to go and get the Unvik trousers or something, I think, because we didn't have the full set. And I'm not going to bother wearing them or anything, it's just to have the set. I feel like we should get all those sets whenever we can. Like, we have the, um, the Northern Realm set, right? And I th guess we're going to go and get the, um, the rest of the Unvik. Then we also need the... The Nilf Guardian one? I'm actually not sure. I think do you get the Nilf Guardian one from Master Armor's quest? Or am I thinking of the wrong thing here? Because I know there is some Nilf Guardian armor in, to do with that quest. I don't think maybe we don't get it. I don't know. It doesn't matter. We'll we'll buy it at some point. We'll buy all the armors we possibly can. Is there even an Nilf Guardian one? I don't know. It's fine. I think there is. Right. Maybe it's in Tucson. <laughs> Hello, I'm looking for uh this okay, he's 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 gone. 
Right, we'll wait till day anyway. It's all right, we can restore some of our stuff. I'm sure we had some things. Just drinking some coffee at the moment. Okay, there's the blacksmith. I don't think it's the right one though, is it? So you're back. Um, I need to have a look at what you got in stock first, mate. Because apparently I forgot to... Okay, we have the armor. Is it the trousers I forgot? Unvic trousers. Oh, that's expensive if it's not what I forgot. I knew I forgot something. I'm, I think it was the, the trousers, right? Oh, God, I don't want to... Okay, fine, fine. I think I forgot the trousers. I'll check. I'll go and check. I'll go and check after. Cheers, boy. I think we already played Gwent with this lad, didn't we? Yeah, we played Gwent with everyone. Okay, right, we'll go and um, we'll go and check, and then um, we'll do some of the on crate stuff, I guess. What? I, actually, tell you what, I'm going to do first. I'm going to do the uh, the cave of dreams just because I want to uh, I want to get that out of the way because well, not out of the way. I want to get that done because hang on, there's actually another thing I want to try out because I um I want to go and play Gwent against Lugos before later in the game because I want to make sure I have that done just in case. There's truth to that blather by the ice giant. I don't know. We'll have to go and see. We have no idea. Who knows? You know? Did you hear? The lift got ah, here we go. Mother. I want to try it. I want to try the lift. Come back up. Return to me. I have no idea if it's up yet. I'll just wait till the rope stops and I'll pull it. You guys are right. I know there's a, the marker up there. I just really want to try out the lift. Wait, let me check. Oh, thank God. So, uh, as I said, I, I never know if I'm recording or not because I'm so bad. Okay, the lift's coming back up. Right, well, wait a minute. I guess I'll just skip it for you guys. Or I'll, I'll chat to these guys. Hey there. Seek no trouble. Wanderer? Mm. Hey there. Huh? Wanderer? I'm a simple chap. Mm. Seek no trouble. Okay, well that was fun. Uh, <laughs> More trouble. I'm, I'm not trouble, alright? I'm just I'm just a witcher. I'm just Geralt of Rivia. I'm coming here. I'm helping out Croc. I'm spinning around. I'm showing you my awesome um it's not a dress, hey, okay? You. Right, let me let me try this. Oh my god! Don't move, Geralt! Heights are your weakness! Every- no, nothing else though, just heights and the occasional wraith, and maybe like if a drowner gets a lucky hit or something, then we're kind of fucked. Oh, I can't move, okay, I was just trying to walk off. Not walk off, but like walk forward a little bit. Look at this though! This is very cool, I like it. I like it a lot. We're almost down. Yo, what's up guys? Oh. Sorry about that. That's the most skeleton noise I think I've ever heard. Right, you hear it everywhere. <laughs> oh, no, don't do that. I mean, um, oh, you're right, laddie. Right, okay. Okay, excuse guys. I need to go and get this signpost and then go and fight Gwent people. So, I don't know. I, I want to get all the Gwent cards because I feel like it's always a pain if you happen just to accidentally miss one. Like, it is actually the worst. My beard is really long already, I just realized. We shaved when we got here, and it's already almost grown back. See, I know where all the signposts are. I mean, I, I can't actually see it now, but I have, like, the general gist of where most of the uh, signposts are in the main cities. Okay, let's have a look here. Oh, yeah, we were going to check the stash. That was, like, the whole reason I came down here. I just remembered. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to be doing so much skipping. I, I keep on, like, just going the wrong way. <laughs> I'm thinking, oh yeah, I gotta do this. Oh wait, no. Not yet. I'll do the other thing. I do really like the bear armor, though. I, th I think it's probably one of my... No, I'd say it probably is my favorite of the school armor. It was the one I used when I first played the game, because I always use sort of heavy armor when I can. But honestly, like, I think it does look the coolest, too. Okay, let's see. Unvic armor. This is what I'm checking here. Do I... I don't have their trousers. So I have the... I have the Unvic armor... I have the Unvic gauntlets. I must have the Unvic boots, right? Unvic boots. And now we have the Unvic trousers. So that should be the full set. So I'm going to transfer. And tell you what, while I'm here, I can put these in, can't I? 
So I'll put all the named swords in. If there's a named axe, I guess I'll put it in. No, these these are just to sell. I guess I can go sell these real quick. Is there? A, I, I don't think there is a smith down here, is there? Look at all our stuff, guys. Okay. Ah, pardon me. Let's go. So, I want to go and do the uh, the Cave of Dreams. I think that's the plan. Where is it? And it's also the lowest quest, so it's good to get it get it done, you know, while, while it's worth it. I think we already went at this guy. I think he used um, some annoying cards on us. I remember him being kind of difficult. Oh, uh, no, he actually beat us, didn't he? And I think about it. Oh, I, I didn't see the Fists of Fury um, here. I don't think... Oh, hang on, wait. Oh, I thought I had two new unlocked things. No, hang on. Fists of Fury, where is it? Oh, my God. I don't know. That's level 30. That's pretty high. That, that, that's like, that's late, later game, you know? I'm sure we could do it, but as I said, let's try not to do things early. We're literally doing a quest that is less than half. Sorry, more than half. Yeah, more than half. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, God, look how many question marks we have. Jesus Christ, look at all that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We haven't even got all the signposts. That is unbelievable. Oh, yeah, I have to finish the sword thing first. I totally forgot that, that that wasn't actually done. It is in the same area, so that's pretty useful, actually. Maybe we can get a signpost. Honestly, I feel like going over this hill is going to be horrible. I'd rather sort of go down. Oh, would I? There's a hill there, too. If I go this way and cut, yeah, I can go from here. I like that. I like that. That's going to work. And then we'll do the Yennefer stuff at some point. It depends. I think it's all the same level as the uh, the Ancrate children thing. So maybe I'll do the Ancrate children thing first. How, uh, I'm trying to think. So we, I have to do the Ceres and Hjalmar quests. Then I do that Yennefer quest. And then I think it moves on to the uh, the feast, right? And then the other quests after that, the brief ones. And that, it's not really that much. I think what's going to take the longest is all these markers and sort of secondary quests. Like compared to Novigrad, I'm trying to think if I'm missing anything. I guess I've already done quite a bit, sort of, in, um, in Skelliger. I've done two parts so far. Last time I just did a bunch of mini quests, I guess, more so than the other ones. Also, how close am I to using higher Ursine armor? Let's check. Because the feline, see, mas that's master crafted. That's only, like, ten levels ahead. So that's the superior, which is level 30. But I'm not looking for superior. I'm looking for, um... Oh, we only unlocked this level 20. I'm going to guess it's like level 24 or 5 or something. I, I can't really remember. But I love riding in Skelliger. And Roach looks amazing with the Unvik armor. Like, I think this is one of my favorites for Roach. Or maybe even my favorite. I'm looking... F Honestly, guys, as I've said the entire playthrough, the area I'm looking forward to the most is Tucson. As much as I love Velen and Skelliger and Novigrad... Uh, you know, actually, it's really hard to say, because if I hadn't been to there, them, those places for a long time, it would be different. Because I, I did a playthrough before starting this playthrough. Sorry, before starting The Witcher 1, even. And then I stopped, literally just because... Hang on. Just because I was doing The Witcher 1, I thought, well, I'll get to The Witcher 3, so I better leave it. And it was just before I got to Tucson. So I haven't been to Tucson in literally, like... Oh, God. Like, years. Like, real-time years. There's a monster here. What is going on? Um, why is there a monster nest? This looks like a- this looks like they're all lined up for me. I let him hit me, that's fine. Oh, I, I just love playing this game, man. I feel like we've been on such a journey together, too, all of us, you know? Like, like, Witcher 1, 2, now 3. I, I, I know I talk about this every time, but it's like, it's when I look at where we are right now and where we started, you know? It's crazy. It's like, this is, the journey of The Witcher 3 has been, like, the the one, well, other than obviously Witcher lore and stuff, the, like, the, the continuous thing throughout the channel, you know? You can see me from start to finish, almost, <laughs> from when I started the channel. Wow. Okay. Sv Svenja. S Svenja? I got good news and bad. I'll start with the bad. Me and, Gr me and Gimre went to Lugos. Gave us the welcome, custom demands, and mead and meat are plenty. But as soon as we unwrapped Kuli from its what how Kuliu Kuliu from its leather and asked how much he'd give us for it, he ripped the blade from our hands and knocked us both on our asses, calling us thieves. He then sent us running from his house, hounds at our heels. G Gimra runs slow, so they got him. That's fine. Only means that oh my god, they killed him. 
And here's the good news. We still got the sword. How? And now I know how to get rid of it. I talked to Steinfin, my brother-in-law, and he'll sell Kuli in Novigrad. Kuliu. Kuliu. Am I saying it right? Kuliu. Kuliu. In Novigrad and split the coin with us after. I know, I know, but I swear you can trust him. I'll give him the sword on the beach by the whale cemetery. So, or cemetery? And on Ard Skellig. I'll go alone so as not to attract attention. Watch out, Lugos might have sent a messenger to Kaer Trolder to inform them of the theft. Just in case, hold up somewhere, maybe with Aunt Hilda. She's not right in the head, but you can rely on her anyway. Cheers, Yurjin. Yurjin. I'm looking forward to meeting this Yurjin. He seems to be coming up a lot in this quest. He's like the main guy, you know? Okay, we, we got a bunch of shit. I mean, I guarantee... There isn't even any... Whatever. Were they eating a horse and a, and a guy? Jesus. Why was there a harpy nest here? Oh well. We, we, um, maybe they killed the harpies? I don't see any dead harpies though. Oh, whatever. So we have, we have to get the thieves now. However, we could go and do that afterwards because we are pretty close to, um, god damn, I got there in the end. Um, because, yeah, look how far away that is. We may as well just go down and do the other quest, the Cave of Dreams, whilst we're here, and then sort of collect stuff on the way up. Yeah, sure, why not? We'll, we'll, we'll we gotta remember to do that. One thing, oh no, no, I remember go, to get the Unvic trousers. That was on my mind, I kept on forgetting, because I said I was gonna do it last time, because I forgot in the first part. But, um, you know, I'll, I'll obviously equip it all at some point. Uh, I think that'd be quite fun. I'm not actually sure if it's better than the bear armor. I, I don't think it is. I think we looked, didn't we? Oh, God. I, sorry, I just had a horrible flashback. I, I've been playing a lot of Red Dead recently, and I, I saw a tree just then, and I thought I was about to lose my horse. I, like, honestly, like I, I, I was like, oh, God. But thank God for the Witcher. You know, because Roach, as careful as she is, it pays off. You know? You know, no no dying for her. Ever. Literally ever. She's, she's going to outlive everyone. <laughs> I mean, she, she actually probably would. <laughs> I mean, Geralt has the power of respawning, but Roach, she has the power of, um, being so careful. You know, n oh, a, a slight incline? Nope. I know what that does to you, Geralt. I'm not letting you risk it. She's like the sensible one in the relationship. You're the player. <laughs> you jump off hills. She's not. She's like, you know what? This'll do. I'm kind of concerned what's going to happen here. Come on, Roach. Do I hear a... Forktail or wyvern or flying monster of some sort of description. I did a video about wyverns recently. Don't eat that cow. Come on, man. That's not cool. Right, we'll kill the wyvern just because we did a video about it. You know, you, you gotta you gotta be on on brand. I don't know. Die for oh fuck! It's a fucking forktail. I I couldn't tell. All right, the royal wyverns have slightly bigger heads. <gasps> Forktails are both lesser draconids, like wyverns. It's the same shit, okay? I, it was red as well. It's like wyvern color. Fuck, man. God damn it. God damn it. See, you can tell I didn't get taught by Vesemir. I'm a self-taught witcher. <laughs> My knowledge is there, but it's quite patchy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Help me. Help me. A boat? Guys? Guys? Okay, right, play it cool. Yo, what's up? How you doing? What do you want? Wanna to talk to Blue Boy Lugos. <laughs> Hear that? He wants to talk to Lugos. What else, Vagrant? Care to plow Freya? I wouldn't no. Um Works Lugos from here, Rain. Expecting me. Lead the way. R right. Come on. Why? I don't get it. Then stay here. Think it over. Thanks, lads. See, they can be helpful. They say come right now. Um, are you leaving? Are you gonna leave me to him, or do I just... Okay. Hmm. Blue boy? You know the last time I had a Continental on my ship? No. When I hauled prisoners from Velen to the <coughs> slave market in Nazaire. Now. Tell me why you're here. Oh, I can no longer not wait till the... Wait, hang on. I can't wait till the feast. That one. Your father felt you could use a witcher's help, and I owe him a favor, so... Told him not to meddle. Told him I'd manage fine on my own. Maybe that's not entirely true. Cave of Dreams. 
Supposed to be a dangerous place. Mortally so, but that's my reason for going there. Fine, so be it, I take you. Old man's like to throw a fit elsewise. Or he's about to go, you ready? Sure, but what's in the cave first? What awaits us in the cave of dreams? Depends wholly on us, cuz... Uh, I'll explain later. Let's go. We can go. Is it far? Nah, stone's throw. Let's gather the lads and go in. We'll know soon if there's truth to the legends. Girls, these are the best warriors in me crew. They'll come with us. You know Yarolf, called the Wolverine? Good day. And this here is Oov Jabberjaw. What? <laughs> it seems quiet to me. Um, okay, right, sure. Why is Oov so quiet? Because he got no tongue. Oh. Makes what sense. happened? He lick a frozen blade? No. He tore it out because he cursed King Bran while drunk. Lost his power to speak, but kept his honor. Interesting customs you got here. Okay, what do you expect to find in the cave? Before we head off, will you tell me about this cave? You could at least tell me what we might have to fight. Only you can know that. Elders say in the Cave of Dreams you face your greatest fears. Face what makes you wake up at night, screaming. Something that's already been, will be, or just might be. I do wonder what a monster slayer fears. But we've talked enough, lads. Swords in hand. Let's go! Okay, blue boy. Let's do this. Oh, I like the shields, guys. I like it. Oh, I like the pike, blue boy. That's a cool weapon. You know, not not enough. Not used enough. Okay, I'll stop talking, guys. <laughs> See, this is what I'd be like on the freaking Witcher adventures. I'd be like Dandelion, but ho hopefully a little bit more, you know, utility. You know, I don't know. He is useful in his own way. If there's one thing I'm not afraid of, it's an echo. I mean, I don't know about you, Geralt, but I have a bit of concern with them. They, they are the pylon lads, you know? Oh god. No idea. Nilfgaard Bane. They do remind me of Nilfgaardians. You know? Playing a lot of Gwent on uh, on the old streams here and there, and yeah, I'd say they remind me of the North Guardian decks pretty pretty freaking well, you know. Very annoying. It piles on. You can't really do anything. But then if you got a bit of firepower, they they fold. Hang on. The totem, right where it should be. Now's when we eat the herbs. Why would we do that? To go on, to where the nightmares are. So says the legend. And so we will do. Sure. Um, what are these herbs? Herbs, what herbs even. are these? Mm, what that druid say? Hemlock, poppy, nightshade, and that chicky. No, uh, henbane. Whoa. In for one hell of a ride. <laughs> it's basically like a narcotic. <laughs> okay. Fine. Give him here. Take it. Oof. Yarl's eat up to the last grain. So we've gone into a weird cave, and now we're doing drugs. I don't feel no different. How about you, Oof? <laughs> You're asking a mute his opinion. You're feeling it, mate. Come on, let's go. Time to face our fears. But he broached was here. She could now probably give us some pretty sound advice. Um, right. Okay, lads, I'm just gonna- I'm just gonna head in. The cave has opened up a lot, apparently? I don't know, I can't even tell anymore. Oh! The spectral whale. Our blue whale is much bigger than that. Oh my god, I can't even see anything, it's just fog on my screen. It's so dark. 
Oh. Okay. Oh, there it is again. This is the Gwent card for Blue Boy Lugos. At least in, um... God, I wonder what Geralt's fear is, huh? It's a weird sect. Hey! Run! It's not possible. I see you're weary from the battle. Sit with me, son. Have some mead. Pray tell your adventures. Thank you, my king. We... I shan't drink with you, old man. And I shan't call you king. Get off that throne while you've still strength in your decrepit bones. Oof. You can talk. Uh, I, I, I... I... I didn't... But I... <gasps> you insult me once more, old Jabberjaw. The first time I left you to punish yourself and retain your honor, but now... Now you'll die like a troll and eels will eat your remains. Oh, shite. Right, we'll save him. By the power of fire and magic. I don't even know. Sure, good enough. Are we using our steel sword or silver one? Oh, we're using our silver. I was curious, just because obviously they're, they're humans ish humanoids i mean they're not humans but you know what i mean like i wonder if in the game they might have been classed as like just hum retextured humans um no they're ghosts okay spooky ghosts that's a good touch i like that we use the silver sword oh there you go Everyone okay? I can't really tell. I'm sort of stuck here. I'm, I'm getting pinned down pretty hard. Oh, he, he actually killed one? Well done! God damn, man. GG. I like it. Okay. I should try and probably um, parry a little bit, you know, because it's kind of a bit of a pain otherwise. Out of the way, guys. Come on. I got bleeding on him? Ow! Oh no, no, I got, I think I got poison because I have that on my sword, right? Okay. We almost, hang on. This is so hard. Wait there. There we go. I love this mission, man. Look at it, the whale again. more to this than just drugs because we're all sharing the same sort of visions you know yeah weird oh and a, a harpy i know that long ship easy. Jarl, it was an accident. The Althing cleared your blame. They couldn't clear my conscience. 
Let's go. So he um, heard the harpies and he crashed the boat and then everyone died but him or something? Or is at least his dad died? I guess... I don't know, I guess fair? You know what? Everyone has demons, you know? I'm sure everyone's got a lot of stuff that they would want people to know. A hag? We're gonna get Yennefer, I'm calling it. <laughs> no, it does say what we're gonna get. We're gonna get, we're gonna get a slight incline and we'll have to climb down it without dying. <laughs> uh. Jesus, maybe this is my nightmare. Oh my god. Look how low my health was. Jesus, I, I dropped the ball on that one. Oh, I can actually loot it now? Damn, I like that. Okay. Guys, this is getting more and more intense. Quiet, calm, suspicious. And really dark. I don't fear nothing. Maybe? There's, there is a house here with some shit on it. Oh, okay. You fear nothing, boy. You! You pissed your trousers when lightning struck the tree by our wall. I was three years old. I've shown a hundred times since then that I... You pissed yourself before the whole village. The Yarl saw it. Ha! The shame should have punished you. You're a vision. A spectre. A vision of your dog, who you fear, because you know you don't live up to him. You know you disappoint him. I'm a better warrior than he ever was. Prove it. Okay, so he's scared of his dad. Sure, fair enough. That's a fair enough fear, I guess. Um, well, not necessarily of like his dad, but more of like he's scared of um, the fact that he won't ever be as strong, or he might not live up to the name of Lugos. I guess. I mean, his dad is pretty intense. I'll give him that. I can't hit him. Die, that is a bit much. Are you okay, blue boy? You are on fire right now. Okay, he's fine. So what, what is this house? Cool. Okay. Jesus, okay. I I, th I think I think they have some unresolved issues, him and him and Madman. We'll we'll, we'll deal with that, sure. <gasps> is this our dream from the start of the game? Okay, I help them. Now they help me. King, king of the wild hunt. It's fun. Okay, I got Eridan, boys. Oh my god. Is Eridan really what Geralt's scared of? I mean, sure, he's got like a cool helmet and stuff, but he's not that scary. Who would I say, if I were to genuinely say what I reckon Geralt's fear is based on the books? I thought, I honestly, like, if I were to... It'd probably be something to do with Siri, right? Like, like obviously this is to do with Siri, but I mean more of like a... You know, just, just, like, the fear wouldn't be fighting something. It'd be more of having to sort of see Siri getting taken away by the wilds and not be able to do anything, you know, something like that. Maybe that's what this is meant to be in a way. But the, the cave just wants to kind of fight us too. Oh, Jesus, that was close. Hang on. I need fire for the wilds, and this isn't working. They're very tall. I like the NL. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Oh. She will still be mine. Over my 
dead body. Nothing simpler. Get up, Garrett. You've paid your debt. You're a free man. Gonna tell your father what you faced in the Cave of Dreams? Of course I will. I've no fear of him, right? Twas an honor to fight at your side. Farewell, Garrett. Well, thanks for all the help, blue boy. Oh, we're back with the, uh, the Neckers. We're right at the start. I kind of want to have a bit of a loot. I, I feel like we haven't really looted anything. We've just sort of come in and... Oh, are all the cave bits closed off now? That'd be really cool if they were. Oh, there's dead people all around. There's a lot of dolls. That, I love that mission, man. It's so cool. It's very creepy. Oh, see, this is why you look, guys. Yeah, some florins, a saddle, and a diagram for a blade I'll never use. That is exactly why I look. The Only the useful stuff here, guys. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, we're getting a lot of florins. It's fine. We'll, we'll convert them whenever I find someone that can. Some, some dude with just some mushrooms. <laughs> Wait, hang on. Are we, are we back out? This is back out? Oh, I went... Did I go, did I go around in a circle? I think I got everything. I could try the other way, just just for sort of good measure. You know what I mean? Just just in case there's some more dead guys like lying on the side or something. You never know. Money is money, as they say. I can't see anything. I tell you what, actually, oh, that's not what I meant to do. Just just in case. So there are some chests. I think they're the ones I had there, right? Yeah. Oh, I think it literally is just a massive circle. Right, cool. So we, we, we didn't need to do that. It's fine. What I'm going to do... That, that was I love that quest. It's very, very cool. I kind of... I'm tempted to do the Yennefer one. But I think I'm going to go and do the Ceres one. No, no, no. No, the the, uh, the, the, the sword first, then the Ceres one. Just cause. So it's a morning. Restore all of our stuff. Switch that back. Look at the awesome skeleton sky with the awesome clouds and the sea that goes out forever and a little... Oh my god, it's so cool. Okay, right. Quests. So we have Echoes of the Past. We have Possession. We have the Family Blade. That's what we're doing. And then we... So... Uh, they're all level 17, so it's kind of like... There's no, there's no order here. I just sort of have to work out what I'm doing. I guess I'll do... Oh, god damn, it's so far away. I tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go here first and get both of these quests, just because I feel like it's sort of, you know, it is kind of half on the way. And I would like to get the uh, the thing while I'm down here, because I have to just come down otherwise, right? I'm trying to call Roach, just just in case you're wondering. It's not working. I'll have to reload. I tell you what, I'll reload real quick because this does happen every so often. Okay, we're back. There we go. I remember I learned that on Xbox One, <laughs> because it, 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 like, I guess on PC you have console commands if you really need to. I don't think I, obviously, well, actually, I haven't. I haven't used a single console command on this playthrough ever. Oh, no, no. Have I? Oh, no, no. Yeah, one, once, once. And there it was yeah. because the skull disappeared from my inventory. I don't know why. I have no idea. It just disappeared from my inventory, so I put it back in my inventory. That was the only time I used it, and it literally, like, I ha obviously you saw on camera that I got the skull, I had the skull, I didn't reload at that point. It was so confusing, it just disappeared, so I think that's like a fair enough thing though, right? Because it's, like, I did get it, like, you saw me get it, you know? It's not really cheating. Um, so I'm fine with that one. Hey, Sirens. Yeah, I'm just coming through here. Hey, White Wolves. Yeah, I'm just coming through here. <laughs> okay. 
I would like to try and also get the um, the bear armor upgrade, and maybe I could do that before all this. Because the way I see it, right, the way I see it with the bear armor, we, we, we want to make the next one as soon as we can, and I'm actually not sure about the level. Because, I mean, we're not going to be close, are we? We're only 21. We could actually, you know what? But We could probably judge by the level of the quest, now I think about it. Because I'm sure the level of the quest would sort of be representative of what level the armor is. Just off the top of my head. I mean, I imagine that'll work. I feel like I don't look around enough, like, when I'm walk when I'm just riding. Because it, it is an awesome place. Like, look at this environment. Fjordsdal. Isn't this where they said they were going to sell some stuff? Tell you what, I'm going to go get the markers. Oh, the, the shield maidens. Clan Drummond. Alright, a contract for a dragon. Oh, I wonder. Probably, probably a wyvern or the forktail. Okay. I, the writer of the snow, to seek the help of a witcher. The work on offer, though, true, but f is tough. Offers tough, but true, but for a witcher, it should be a breeze. I'll pay well. Time's short, so don't tarry anyone. Okay, cool. So that's the dragon, right? So I'm assuming it's this guy, right? Hello. Greetings again. See. I had no intention of cheating. Oh my god, it's you. You're lucky. I'm not exactly known for being forgiving. Still, take my advice. Find a new profession. Awesome. Oh my god, it wasn't even the guy. I just 200 crowns. God, it took its time, didn't it? I feel like I, I should talk to these guys while I'm here. They wielded swords for the men. Carried fetters for the women. I'm assuming there'll be someone to Gwent here. Oh, there is a merchant. Hang on. Parkour. I'm right. Hello. Ah. See you come from afar. Order up. Sure. I actually just want to play Gwent and buy cards off you if you sell them. So that's all I want, really. The Lonesome Call. Um, oh, actually, does that give me, like, all the markers? Reading this guidebook will unlock certain fast travel points. Ah, I think that'd be cool. I really want to get... I'm going to get it. Fuck it. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. That was so expensive. 200. But I get to unlock fast travel points, and it's an item I'd never used. Wait, hang on. Let me have a look. It was in here, right? Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, it's just a bit of information about Hindisfjall. See you. Oh, so now we have markers there without even having to go there? That, that's kind of cool. We get oh, yeah, I, I made a bunch of new decks, didn't I? I have my um, my Nilfgaard one. I want to make a monster deck. I don't really have the cards, though. I have two of the crones. Yeah, I don't really have the cards yet. I could just use the uh, the Nilfgaard one. I do like it. As much as I made fun of it earlier, I do like Nilfgaard as a, as a deck. I'm going to go with it. Just because it has Letho. I really like Letho. I think he's such a cool card. Sorry, I wasn't even talking to the microphone then. <laughs> I literally had leaned the other way because I was looking at the Gwent cards. Um, okay. God damn, I don't know. I want to keep Asira if I can. Isn't our ability like... Hang on. Oh, I can't. Okay. Hang on, what's our, is our ability like double the range draw? Is that, is that not what I used? I used that on something, right? Find any cards in your... Oh no, maybe it's that sort of like Scoia'tael one. I just know I have like the the equivalent of the double the sea draw, but for the ranged on one of them. So that's three. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to bait him. I'm going to put that down. And if he skips, I'm going to put down the 15. So he's got 18 now. Right, I'm gonna put down the the uh, the six just in case. Jesus, I guarantee he's gonna double that row, isn't he? See, I can do this though, and I get double. Hang on, how far off are we? Damn it. So if I double those two, I... Yeah, I can do this. 
and then I put just down a 10, right? Then I've still got the a bit, quite a bit of an advantage, actually. And I can bleed him. Yes. Not enough yet. Right. I'm going to try and get just like a really heavy lead here, then skip. So I'm going to get that into a cedar. Oh my god. The crones, really? Yikes. I might just whack down Siri, why not? I might be able to two crown him. I'll tell you what I'll do, I'll, I'm gonna, I may as well use my ability, right? Just, just to have a little check. Oh, it's not really got much, has he? So he's got a pass now, I'll use his ability? Yeah, I have one, I have one. Boom. There you go, merchant. Thank you for that. If you give me the final crone, that'll be cool. Damn it. Oh, Imlareth is good, though. Damn, I can build up the monster deck. Imlareth? That's is, that is like a gold off a merchant. Jesus. That's better than, like, half the other cards. I could... Okay, awesome. God damn, he's like, okay, he, you know what? You beat me so bad. Here's my best card. Literally his best card. I mean, the crone obviously would have been cool, but, I mean, that's a pretty, 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 pretty good get, you know? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go to the miners camp and I'm going to head down here and grab this notice board. Oh, hang on. Wait, there's there's the contract here, right? Like, I may as well get it done while I'm... Like, not get it done, but like... Oh, we have Woodland Spirit now. It's this one, right? I'll, I'll, I'll do all the contracts later. I have the signpost now. So I also got um one some Hindusfjall stuff, right? Ugh, hang on with that. Where the hell? Where's Hindusfjall again? I thought it was, um... There we go, there's Hindusfjall. So, we got this marker, I guess. Cool. Oh yeah, I was actually meant to be fast traveling. So, I'll get this sword, then I'll go and do the Ceres mission, I guess. Um, I was gonna do the Hjalmar one, but I kinda wanna save that one till last. What I think I'll do is that I'll do the Ceres one, and depending on how much time I have left, and I might have quite a bit of time, then I can actually do the Hjalmar one as well. So, I could even do both. I don't know how long the Ceres one is gonna take though, because I know it's- it's not exactly long, but it's not exactly short. You know what I mean? I know I have a few missions with Yennefer, obviously. Hang on. I just wanna kill this guy. I feel like I can get some ingredients off it. I actually passed this guy before. Did you know, um, Spear Tips a Cyclops, but he's, um, like a different variation of it? I remember for the longest time I thought he was a giant, but, um... I think like a, maybe like a year ago, I was looking at videos to do for lore, and I, I noticed that he actually was apparently a Cyclops, and I, I thought, wow, that's really interesting, so I just thought I'd mention it. Someone actually asked me the other day, and I remember thinking, god, that's so, that's such like, that's so odd, because no one ever asks, and I remember it being this thing that I was confused. Oh. Sure. Blood hasn't even dried. This is a quest? Oh, cool, I just killed it because, you know, it's a Cyclops. Wasn't a fair fight. Didn't stand a chance. I mean, you know, girl. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, some footprints. Fresh. Wait, what? How, what level is this? Ah, uh, that's fine. I guess we may as well do it. We've stumbled across it. We'll RP it. Aha. Uh -huh. Blood hasn't even dried. That's a massive bear. <laughs> Bear, I will kill you because I know you'll just pounce me. Sorry, Bear. I don't like killing bears, but obviously it probably would have just jumped me at some point. Okay, I guess we'll carry on looking. So we need footprints, right? Aha! Oh. Blood hasn't even dried. Oh, I don't like these guys. Hang on. 
Okay. That's a lot of ingredients. I like that. Hang on. What? What? Can I make any mutagens? I just realized I haven't really been making them. Uh, yes, I can. Make a lot of blue ones. I find red ones are definitely the bottleneck in this game. So, am I using one? I don't even know what I'm using. I think I'm using... Yeah, I am. So, I have the greater blue. It's the red that I need to try and improve. So, I have one red. Remember that, just in case I need to uh, put them together at some point. Went this way. Okay. Went this way. Ah! Another victim. That's to ya Yane? Yane! Or y Yane. My dearest son. Ill is our lot of light. Singer's husband's ship crashed and stormed during its last expedition. Bjorn survived, thank the gods, but weeks will pass before his captains build another. And meanwhile, life must go on. We weren't... Sorry. We weren't taken on for, for the building, so he's earning no coin. Oh, he weren't taken on for the building, so he's earning no coin. We're eating our winter stocks now, and I fear to think what we'll do when they run out. That's why I'm sending Singer to you, and asking for your help on behalf of us all. If you can, find work for Singer, and then Bjorn and I will come to Kjertrolder to stay with you. Perhaps there's some work for Bjorn with you at the forge. And if you work, and if and if work is scarce around Kjertrolder as well, lend Singer a few coppers, at least. And I'll give it all back with interest once we're out of this plight. With, belov with, with belief in your good heart, and thanks in advance, your loving mother. Well, well, well. Oh, I guess we do that at some point. I'll finish this goddamn blade quest first, because Jesus Christ. I can't, there's so many distractions. It's, it's amazing, though. That, that's why the game is so cool. It's like, oh, you want to do this? Oh, well, what about this? It's like, oh, well, yeah, that sounds good. It's like, think, if I had been a high enough level, Faster. that dragon thing would have distracted me too, then I would have come down here, and then I would have had that, and then I, I wouldn't have even finished the quest. No, I'm sure I would have eventually, but like at the end of the part. Okay, but I do want to go here first. I want to get the markers. I don't like that noise. That's creepy. Hmm. I mean, I'd hate to go traveling in the Witcher world if I actually lived in it. Like, oh my god, just just the monsters everywhere. Like, look at Geralt. Like, he just about survives, and he has a horse. Like, imagine walking. You would just die. Yeah. Me too. Awesome. How have you got? Alright, let's check what you got, mate. Oh, you got some... Some... Some, uh... Some some cool. <laughs> I'll take it. Hang on, wait there. I do want to read this. What is it? It's under other, right? From what I remember. I have quite a few florins actually. I got two hundred. Like I'm sure I could get something from that. Okay. Unskelic is black. Cool. I don't know why I'm buying these. Did that even give me anything? That literally didn't give me anything. Amazing. Just a complete waste of money. I'll buy them whenever I see them. You know what? That's my Gwent money. That's what the Gwent money goes into. It was the Nilf... Sorry, it was the Skytel one, right? Just to make sure. I'm not being insane here. I can't even check. Yeah, yeah, it was. Okay. Um, well, I'm gonna go Nilfgaard. Unless I have Yorbeth. No, I don't have him yet. Oh, I did, I did actually get Imlareth, didn't I? I can't believe that I got me Imlareth. Like, Jesus. Sure. I like trying out the other decks just a bit here and there. I've done a lot of Northern Realms, and I feel like, you know what? I like this one. The way I see it, I get the double art anyway. Oh, I don't want to open. Ah, uh, sure. <laughs> Ooh. Oof. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, uh... Yeah, totally. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I see what you're doing, I see what you're doing. Well, I'm just gonna get really far ahead. Oh, not playing like a complete moron. By the power of spy spam, I will beat you. Yeah, that's what I was waiting for. Oh, 
Oh, I should have put that on the front. No, 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 I got dandelion. It's fine. Well, that, that that's pretty bad. Um, gonna be honest, could have been better. At the end of the day, if he does kill my spy, it's not too bad. And now I can do the spam. There's only so many golds you can play, man. Ugh, do I put this on the front? I feel like no, because I can revive the... Yeah. Okay, I made him play a lot, and I can revive the spy. That does give him a nine, though, which which is quite good, actually. No, no, I think I think getting the spies is just the the strat with Gwen. You you can't start changing stuff. At the end of the day, if he puts anything on the front, I'm sure I could just fill in Threat and Mirth revive kill. So I'll sort of leave it for now. I guess I could have used my ability, but um, it's kind of a terrible ability to be honest. Okay, sure. So what is Villain Tretmuths if it's equal to 10 or more? So it's not actually equal to that. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. Because then I can play into this. Which then allows me to play into this. Which then allows me to double. Boom. And you know what? Just cause I'm going to revive that 10. See how high I can get. Oh, I should have done a Villain Tretmuth then. I could have got the double. Oh well. Good enough. Good job, Merchant. Give me a good card. Um, I don't know if that's good. I don't think it is. It's not named, so. There you go. Yes, actually, it was a it was a fun time. Okay, so we have the contract. I think it looked like there was two quests I was supposed to get here, but um, there you have disappeared now, which is interesting. We have a location to get down there. I could just get these locations on the way up, which I think I will, because it means I don't have to come back and like mess around. I could just walk, you know. Best place not worth shite if a weak arm swinging at eight. Yeah, Skellige lads, you got me. What are you trying to say, huh? Because the way I see it, I'm gonna probably have like a really long part where I've got to just get all these goddamn markers because there is so many in the sea, and I just remember I actually remember that being a thing in Skellige, that the goddamn the sea the sea markers are the worst. Uh huh. Praise be to Freya, our great mother. They said the road was fraught with danger, this, that sea devils awaited any who traveled it, that a bandit lurked behind every tree. But I sacrificed a lamb to Freya and donned an amulet made of falcon feathers, or falcon feathers. And lo and behold, I traversed the entire island without so much as drawing my sword. Mm. And did some damn fine trading along the way. Packed my chest so full of silver and other treasures that my back near snapped setting it on the wagon. As if everything goes as planned, I'll be home by tomorrow. Around sunset, I owe the goddess a mighty leaf for the tender care she's giving me. Oh, yikes. Okay, we'll go and nick all this stuff. He got drowned. It happens to the best of us. Well, oh, Merc, whatever the fuck they are. Okay. Get fired! Give me that potion. Through. Absolute badass. I only got hit like three times. God damn, I feel like I've lost so much of my my prowess in this game. It's all gone. I have too much shit in my mind. I've got so much to deal with in these other games. The Valkyrie Queen ruined me in God of War, okay? It has ruined me. All I can think about is that freaking shield block. Okay, hang on, weather. Oh, that's a lot of shit. I'm sorry, merchant, you will be missed. I could obviously return this to the family he was going back to, but, um, you know, they didn't need a sword, right? And all the money, you know, that's just, that's, uh, you know, money isn't happiness, you know, and you know what? 
They should have killed the drowns if they won the money. <laughs> okay. We're an evil asshole today. That's the plan. Oh, hang on. Oh, that's the site? Shit, maybe I should do that then. If it's on the way... Ugh, fine. It's on the way. I'll do it. I was going to do all the Hjalmar and Serra's stuff first, but this is literally on the way to where I'm going. I tell you, there is, as I said, there's like a hundred distractions every single time. Without fail. Every single time. You know what? I can maybe go in Ermion. It's fine. Jesus. Every time. It's like, oh, I better go and do the sword quest. Oh, there's Yennefer. Sure, I'll go and chat to her for a bit. Deal with that while it's on the way. It is, it is a good way to play the game, though, I think. It, like, it realistically makes sense. Geralt's sort of on his way to see Yennefer, because he's got the sword to grab, and he thinks, oh, well, I'm on the way to the Cataclysm site. I better go and see Yennefer. She wanted me there at some point. See if she's still hanging around. Here they are. Right there. Let, let, me, let, me, let me make a save. You never know. I know a lot of stuff is about to happen. Druids? You're mad, woman. Oh. Mad. Magic. A place of power. They're talking about Siri. I can kind of see them. I can't really hear them anymore. This thing is really loud. So they're talking about using the mask. Can I take shit? Nice. Can hear you two clear on the other side of the island. Good. May all Skellige know. Jennifer of Vengerberg is a common thief! Control yourself, druid. I haven't stolen anything. I've merely borrowed something and fully intend to return it. Ha! The generosity. Just one small problem. Once used, the mask is rendered completely worthless. Not to mention the risk you'll bury us alive and all the Isles with us! What are you talking about? Sorry, sure you're not overreacting? Let's see. Barry, what are you talking about? She's not told you? Might have expected as much. The myth is that Urborus created the mask when the envious seas swallowed his beloved. Unable to bear the prospect that he would never again see his betrothed, Urborus made the mask, which would allow him to peer into the past. He knew, however, that he could only use it once. So he waited. Waited until his longing grew so strong that it became unbearable. When the sea learnt of the mask, it was quick to respond. It made known its threat that whosoever used the mask would bring the sea's wrath down on them. For in vengeance, the sea would rise and flood all the lands and drown the living. Anyone ever used <laughs> Geralt, come on. <laughs> Where do you get this mask? Sailors from Clan Dimmon pulled it from the sea, near the Njord Trench. Yeah, but how can you be sure this is Urboros's mask? Its appearance is exactly as described in the myths. You believe the myths? Only ignorant fools belittle their significance. Besides, it's not the myths that are on trial here. It's the thief. Okay. Tried to understand Yen. She did it for Siri. We've got Crocs permission. I'm just going to say that. On the one hand, a theft. On the other, Siri's life. I also care deeply for the girl. I proposed a series of other methods. Yennefer refused to listen. She claimed they would take too long. For as she wants, she needs immediate results. She has always been hot-headed. True. At least this time she's got a valid reason for it. Never mind that she might bring... Huh. What was that? No. Yennefer's used the mask. Well, Yennefer, um... Cool, I guess we'll get you later, Ermian. <laughs> Sure. Oh, this little merchant fella. Oh, look at him. He doesn't know what to do. <laughs> Yennefer? Yennefer? Merchant? Oh, there's a druid. Look how cool that is.
Okay, I think we get it. Cool. Well, awesome. That was really cool. Yennefer? Great. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Thanks, Yen. What was that? Unicorns. Damn it, Yen. I saw the foglets. I meant how'd they get here. The power of the mask summoned them. God damn it. <laughs> okay, right. Ermian's furious with you. Ermian says the mask might cause a natural disaster. Fortunate he's here then. He can jump right in, try to tame it. Realize he won't let this pass. Oh, I'll survive somehow. Jesus. What now? The mask reveals the past, but only in certain places. Places where past events left a strong magical imprint. Take it. Want me to wear it? Yes. I'll cast a spell that will let me see through your eyes. Okay, gonna read my mind. Sure, why not? Gonna read my mind again? You object? Nah. You do it whenever you want anyway. No harm in it then, is there? Let's go. Already found the first spot. Need a magneto helmet. Um, you have a new quest item. Prepare to use it by placing in the appropriate slot in the adventure panel. Like, okay, cool. I think it should all be... Yeah, it's already equipped. I'll use the mask. We'll do. I'm trying. Aha. So there's Siri on the left and... Um, What's that? Guy on the right. Two people emerged from it. I don't want to say the, the names. Woman was Siri. How can you know? The way she moved, like a witcher. Seems they went that way. Come, Sway in there. Let's hips. find the next spot. Am I seeing something? Oh. Die, Foglet! Ow. Watch out! Yen, okay. This is my job. I don't- I don't make fun of you for stealing masks, that's your job, right? Okay, hang on. Ooh. What was that? Hmm. A magic explosion of some sort. So powerful that even the echo was dangerous. I wager it destroyed the forest. But Siri and her companion weren't harmed. I saw them escape. Let's see where to. This is creepy. Mm. I don't like it. Nor do I. Anyone here when this happened had a slim chance of surviving. I know what you're thinking, but don't worry. Siri can take care of herself. Okay. Ah! Damn it. I hate these things. Okay. Right, Yen, let's carry on. I think there's a bit down here. Well, ready? Mm hmm. Someone chased Siri. See that? Might have wounded her. She escaped. Yeah, like a portal. portal. Know where it led? You... Magic residue trail leads to Velen. Any oh. chance you can figure out where Siri's companion fled to? His portal's got to be nearby. I'll try to find it. Come. Okay. Wait, which way? Down here? Right. Still raining. Don the mask. Oh, nice fight. One repelled the other with powerful magic, then fled through a portal. A mage? Most likely. Okay. Or a, perhaps a sage. It's Ciri's companion and the one who wounded her. How do you know? I don't. Making an educated guess. They both appeared in the previous visions. Ciri's got a powerful ally. Where did the mage flee to? The mage who was with Ciri fled too. Nowhere? Hmm. His trace path leads to Velen as well. But the target coordinates of his portal differ from those of Ceres. The explosion must have disrupted his teleportation. Hmm. 
ran into Kira Metz in Velen. Coincidence, maybe, but she claimed a mage came to her looking for Ciri. Be surprised if it wasn't the same one. Whoever he is, he grows more interesting by the minute. Okay, let's see where the attacker landed. Maybe something left of the one who got hit by the spell. It's clearing up. Ermion must be getting a handle on the weather. Which means he'll be free to attack us again. Are you pleased with yourselves? Look at what you've brought down on us! If someone's death were to help you find Ciri, would you start making human sacrifices as well? Um, calm down. Nothing happened. I would. I don't think I'd start sacrificing people. Relax. Storms died down. You've clearly got things under control. For now. But who knows what will be a week or two on? Stop panicking. Here's your mask. It is worthless. It's an unwieldy ashtray at best. I hope you've learned something useful at least. Very. I'm talking to Geralt. You. You I'll deal with later. So? We learned something about Ciri. We think a powerful curse was cast here. Mm. Plausible. Considering what happened to the wood, do you know upon whom? Not yet. But we know Ciri was here. She stepped out of a portal. A mage was with her. Someone chased them. They fought. Ciri was wounded but managed to escape. Where to? Velen, probably. The mage opened a portal for her, then he fought her attacker. Yes? Is that it? We need to examine one more trail. Got a feeling we've found something interesting. Just need to examine one more thing. Mm-hmm. Something's pinned under that tree. Can you... Oh, I can. This is so cool. Armor's clean. No blood, no sword mix. Ciri's friend must have... What do you call it? Vaporized him. Exquisite. The armor. Oh, the workmanship's unfamiliar. Can't even tell where it's from. Probably because it belonged to a rider of the Wild Hunt. What? So it's true? The Wild Hunt? I feared as much. First here, then on Hindersfjall. What did they want? They're looking for Ciri. But why? Walton wants her because of the elder blood in her veins. Elder blood flows in Ciri's veins. Tis <sighs> true, she can trace her lineage clear back to Lara Duran, which is why the women in her family have always had extraordinary abilities. But could that truly be so important? Ciri's exceptional. She travels between places here and other worlds. Space is no obstacle for her. Huh? Which is why the Wild Hunt wants to capture her. You said the Wild Hunt was on Hindersfjall. Speaking of the hunt, mentioned it appeared on Hindersfjall. Well, it happened at least a fortnight after the cataclysm struck here on Ard Skellig. The raids raided Lofoten at dusk in a blizzard. Itself a strange occurrence for that time of year. The islanders said the wraiths. They barged into their huts, killed anyone who resisted, then galloped inland, laughing fiendishly. Anyone survive? A dozen or so women, and an old man. Next stop, Hindersfjall. I'll meet you on the beach near Lofoten. Let's go together right now. No, we'll see you there. Mm-hmm. See you there. Good luck to you. Inform me once you've learned anything new. Do you want to play Gwen? I'm in. I'm in. We talk? Yes. You were made a Hierophant. Congratulations. I thank you. The Skellige Circle chose me years ago. About the time when the old disputes between the clans were reigniting. Job's been mainly politics then. Aye, but I've not minded. Since time immemorial, the druids have wandered betwixt the clans, keeping endless feuds in check. We care for equilibrium, the balance of all things. 
not just trout populations and streams. We're lucky the Jarls always valued us as advisors. The war, how will it end? The war, curious to know your opinion. Well, I believe Emir's chosen a poor time to wage it. Hard to find any better as I see it, with the North now in disarray. The North is weak, true. But I've the impression the Emperor is dealing with some domestic strife. Far too much to start a war. Radovid is a madman, but a cunning one. He's certain to take advantage. A round of Gwent, but maybe? Wouldn't happen to play Gwent, would you? Certainly. I got my first deck, oh, years ago, back in Sintra. Proceeded to teach the game to half of Skellige. Why do you ask? Looking to play? Yes. Yeah, glad to play around. In the middle of this storm, in a burnt down forest. Sure, let's go for it. Actually, oh wow. Why is he Northern Realms? That is a, why is he not, I don't know. Okay, so maybe I should put Villain Trentonmurth in for another card. I don't know, I kind of, no, I like the deck as it is. I'm going with Northern Realms because I'm tryharding because I want to win. You know, it's pretty obvious. I think you guys should be cool with that. <laughs> okay. So I'll start with, um, um, I'm going to start with that. I'll go with the six. Uh, I kind of want to go with the eight, but also I don't because, you know, I don't want to die, but, you know, it's still... I'm going to put the 8 down, and I know it's mainly because if I double, then it means that if he scorches, it should be fine. I'm going to double now. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm going to give him the spy now. Cool. I might just put Geralt and Siri down, you know? Huh. I'm still gonna do it. Okay, he's one point behind. I can skip now. I would have restored, um, the spy. Eh? How does he have that? Oh, did, did, is that what he restored? I have no idea what just happened. Okay, fine. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna scorch the crones. Sure, that, that's quite a good kill, I think. Two sixes. Okay. Okay, now we can go. So let's try and get as many doubles as possible. May as well. I'm gonna I'll restore like as much of this this row as I can, then double it all. I mean, I, I know I'm gonna win. I, I just it's mainly just in case, you know. I wanna I wanna see how how much I win can win by, you know. I always like to see. Okay, it's fun. Yes. Okay, I mean, well done. Lovely. Hey, congratulations. You've a good deck, but it could use a bit of supplementation. Here, take this card. Thanks. You've a knack for it. So much so, you ought to challenge Krach. I gave him his deck, introduced him to the game. But the pupil has surpassed his master. There's also Bremist, a vile character, but undeniably talented. Sure. Oh, he gave us the lesson. <gasps> Amazing. Oh, oh yeah, where are you going? Okay, well, I want to do that. But what I'm going to do first is I'm going to get this goddamn sword. Um, I'll get the markers on the way up. I'm going to get this goddamn sword thing. 
And then I'm going to go to Ard Skellig because I do want to actually... I need to do the crack thing, but I also need to bring that letter from the other marker. So I can do the crack, the crack thing then. I just got a new quest. Missing persons. Awesome. Happy with that. Let's go. Let's do it. We're getting through it, guys. We're doing it. We're, we're accomplishing. I've, I did the Enifer quest. You know, it's good. We got that one done. It was not meant to be done yet. I was planning to do all the Sarah stuff first, but it was just on the way, and I kind of thought, you know what? We're literally next to it. So, uh, let's do it. Oh, hang on. And draggers, huh? Just go past. Okay. Yennefer, we're coming. Well, no, no, we're not. We're, we're gonna do other things first. I'll actually, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make sure I have that other quest on, just in case I forget. So, yeah, the missing persons thing, and then the family blade. Why is, why is that a lower quest than the one we yeah. just did? The, the next quest is lower. Literally lower. Okay. Well, we get the marker. Maybe it'll be like a monster nest, I imagine, or some shit. Or a bandit staying, or... What level are you? Yeah, fuck that. Okay. Well, we know this one is something we can't do yet. Very reminiscent of the Witcher 1. Um, we'll grab this one. As I said, remember our system, guys? It's always like... I think when we get to, like, level 30, everything that we couldn't do before should probably be sort of doable, right? Obviously, when we get the Mastercrafted Armor at some point, that'll make probably everything in the base game doable without question. You know, like, everything will probably be doable by the time we're 30, but, you know, without question, it'll be doable by the time we're, like, 34 or whatever. Okay, this I, I'm kind of concerned now. I didn't realize quite how far down this was. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why you make saves. Oh, okay. We'll try it again. Okay, 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 we're fine, we're fine. Stay cool, stay cool, stay cool, stay cool, stay cool. Stay cool, stay cool, stay cool, stay cool. Stay cool. A place of power. Oh my god. That was incredible. Fuck that. Okay, we also know that is with a too high enemy. The more you know. We're learning, see? <laughs> God damn it. Uh, this is why I don't want to go into all the markers. I want to wait till I'm like level 30 and then I just know I'll be able to do all of them. Oh, I'm getting chased now. I'm getting chased. I'm getting run down like a dog. Oh, I don't like harpies. Oh, God. Okay, we're safe. Oh, we're at the white, whatever, gra uh, whale graveyard or something. Right, you guys, you guys are doable. See, this is doable. Okay, well we did that. Roast chicken, some piggy hide, some more piggy hide, some more, oh a fossil, nice. I'll take it. it. Said valuable. It literally said valuable. Yay, some some rope ladders. I guess we got glowing ore, that's actually really good. Can I break these bar barrels? They look pretty breakable. Cool, anything in there? Nah, no, just, just a bit of fun. Bit of barrel breaking. So we're looking for some more thieves. We just killed some of their friends, so sure. Hey guys, sorry about that. It was it was like a thing. Ah, this is gonna be fun, isn't it? Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? Drink up. Okay. I found the thieves. I don't think they're the thieves, but they're certainly thieves. Oh, is this a whale? There is something dead here. Ah! I forgot I had that equipped. Hang on. Oh, 
Oh! That was a bit better, guys. That was a... Oh, we got the sword. Jesus. God damn. Oh. S Svenja. I've been sitting with these damned whale carcasses for ages and still no sign of Steinfin. Either he's wrecked against the rocks or he's left me high and dry. I told Anka not to bring that bastard into this. Now I don't know what to do. Who else would be willing to buy this sword? Maybe we ought to take it back to Care Trolder. Maybe Krak will laugh and let it all l laugh. Krak will laugh. And maybe, maybe Krak will laugh and let it all slide. Let it all slide. Remember how it stank in the hut when that rat died behind Ma and Dar's bed? Well, it stinks even worse here, and it's cold. Right back soon. Or better, come. Yarn. Or Eerie, Eerie, Eerian, Eerian, I don't know. Well, one of them is still around, right? I guess we'll give it to the guard. We'll, gi we'll give him back their sword, but it's still... Oh, Jesus Christ. L l let's ignore the wolves. Still, though, got it now. I don't think there's much here. Okay. We've got a marker, too. So, there is some stuff still there. But I'll go to Care Trolder. I'll deliver it to this guard. Yeah. I think... Where is it? Up there? Is that up high or not? I don't know. Hopefully not. We'll just go there. And then, we'll go and deliver the letter, too. Because that's something we've got to do. And then... We'll also, um... Gwent Croc. And you know what? Just because I want to set it today, I'm going to set it today. And we can see more. Oh, I love that. We're like turning in three quests at once. That that is such a that's such a good use of time. <laughs> you know? It's like I'm not just coming back for one thing, I'm coming back for three things. That is incredible. Very rarely does it line up so well. Imagine if I'd done the Ceres and Hyalmar stuff too, and I had to come back as well. All like four, I don't know. A, a lot. What I'm gonna do is the Ceres Hyalmar stuff, and then I'm gonna go and do the Yennefer stuff, and then I'll come back, I guess. I, in fact, I think I have to do the Yennefer thing first. But I mean, like, all the Yennefer stuff, or the majority of it. Olaf. What is it? Retrieve the property you lost. Could you? Thanks be to Freya, where'd you find it? Northern part of the Isle, near the Whale Cemetery. Don't ask me how it got there, long story. At any rate, don't need to worry about the thieves. They won't steal ever again. Your reward. Sure as hell earned it. And a lot a bit more from myself. If Kill you'd not been found, I'd have had to wash the shame away with my own blood. Okay. Well, I found the sword. There you go, merchant. Greetings. Yes. Got any maps? <laughs> nah, nothing. Oh, he's got these. Oh, that is very expensive, but it means I don't have to travel to any other place. They all have ports anyway. But but imagine if I had all of them. Oh, fuck it. Waste all your money! That is what I preach. And I will practice what I preach. You know what? I can sell them all my crappy hide and stuff. It's fine. Look. We'll make our money back. See? See? Look. We found a merchant. He buys hide. We can sell all our shit. Fucking valuable fossil my ass. Okay, right. Gold. Uh, I don't want. I don't want to sell that. And you never know with gold. The rakes are actually kind of. They piled up a bit there. They they actually cost a bit more. Yeah, we'll sell all the junk and crap. I I literally have no idea what the vials are used for. I think potions maybe, but I I make like I have most of the potions I need. I'd like to. Oh yeah, I was actually talking about that. I want to make more oils. I should probably keep some fur, right? I'm sure I can buy the ingredients I need if I do end up needing it. This will be expensive, surely. See, we haven't made the money back. We did just spend a lot, though. And he will have had his own money. I do have a lot of swords I want to sell now I think about it. All those axes, right? At the moment, I just feel like selling all this junk is probably a good idea. Like, if he's going to take it, sure. I'm not sure who he's going to sell it to... I'm sure there's, there's something for everyone, right? Always. Melitale figure. I kind of want to keep that. I like that. I like that. I've got a little Melitale figure or Melitella. I want to keep the Dimerotium shackles. I'm surprised I don't have more. Because I, I swear I, I looted every single Dimerotium shackle that I could. Oh, are these things from... um? They're the quest items. Oh, I don't want to get rid of them. Can I buy them back? I don't want to sell quest items. Okay, that'll do. I'll sell the rope ladders too, sure, why not? 96. Okay. 
cool. We got all our money back and we got all these maps. So, long. so that means we should have all the markers? I don't even know. I just bought them because I kind of feel like they're something that's cool. Like, if, if it's cool, why not? Okay, see? You don't need to read them. Ooh, where are you going? Fucker. So... So now we should have all the uh, the marker the markers, right? Yeah, look, look, look. So that means we don't have to travel there by boat. I don't even know, man. I do have some other things I need to do while I'm here. So we have to deliver the letter. So we deliver the sword. We need to deliver a letter now. That one. And then we need to also Gwent Krak. Where is he? Is is he in care troll to this guy? Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll go there. We'll get that marker. I kind of want to do the uh, question mark at the top, too. I don't know what that is. It, I'm assuming it'll be like a place of power or something. Because it's high up, you know? That's generally what I imagine. Otherwise, it's, it's basically stealing. Hey, shield maiden. Uh -oh. I, didn't, I didn't do anything, all right? Right. So we have to go and we have to do this. Then I have to get up there. How do I get up there? What's up there? Look at that. Huh. We'll have a look in the future. For now, what we'll do, we'll talk to Krak. I want to make some more oils. I really want to make some more blade oils, because I feel like I, I haven't really been doing that. And I, I talked about how I didn't, I never really bother, and that is true. However, I feel like I, I feel like I should if I can. Like Spectre, Relict. I don't really have many default oils. Maybe, have I actually made a lot of oil? <laughs> like, okay, I've made a little bit. I have a lot of enhanced, I have some hybrid, I have a few based oils. I don't know. We're missing quite a lot of oil, I feel like. Hey, so that's uh adornment. You? Melt this blade and forge it again. You uh I have to give this um note to somebody? You? Stop your hollering To the Smith, yeah, it is this guy. Bloody hell, he's always on that bloody anvil. Okay, come on, come on, I got like five seconds. There you, you go. In the web? Uh, there you go. I think I have something that was meant for you. A letter from me mum. Says here me sis was bringing it. How'd you come by it? I gotta, I gotta tell him. Came across some bodies in the woods. Victims of a monster attack. Found this letter on one of the dead, a woman. Sing is dead. Ah, told her and mom so many times. Come over, live with me. No, I had to stay on Pharaoh. I gotta send someone to fetch her body. I'm sorry. Thanks for bringing word. Not every man will go to the trouble. Here, take this. Sorry about that, man. Jesus. I feel bad about that. I, I wish I... I don't want to take any money, but, like, you sort of have to. You know what I mean? Like, as in, you literally have to. You have no option to say, no, it's fine, man. Okay. So we have Krak, and then we have G Gremist. Or, as I like to call him, Grimer, because I'm an ass. Oh. Okay, we're going to Gwent Krak. Do I have time to really do the Ceres thing? Maybe I should just finish off with some witch contracts and next time do, like, a Ceres Hjalmar special, you know? The children. Got me eye on you. Look, man, I haven't done anything. I'm just gonna Gwent crack. I'm a good friend of his. Look, hey, man. Wanted to talk. Staring at a pole, crack. Is that what you do? Okay, cool. You ever play Gwent? Ha! Hermione taught me the rules and gave me a deck. Wish to play. I can't help my own children, Geralt. I have to stare at this wall all day. Oh, uh, sure, let's play. Let's play. Right, let's go. I'm gonna beat you. I'm sorry, crack. It must be done. What did I get from Ermion? I'm assuming I got like a... I don't know, man. Um, a gold of some kind? Oh, yeah, the Leshen, I remember. So, well, I saw, and then I remember that it was that card. Oh, yeah, because I was excited. Okay, we got Tancred. I like that. I like that. Uh, honestly, not too fussed with this hand. I like it. Let's go. Like, not too fussed with changing it around too much. You know what? I'm going to open strong. I always like opening strong. It forces them to play their best cards. 
Oh, sure, I win. Amazing. Good win, guys. Okay. And now we play all our trash cards, I guess? I don't really have any trash cards. I could just try and get like a really early lead. Okay. I want to try and bait him into a Scorch because then I could put these two down and get like that really major buff with his ability. And then just skip and leave it. I'm going to be so mad if he, if he kills these now because he hasn't Scorched. He has a Draug though. A lot of monster decks, isn't there? We're gonna get so high. If he, I mean, the thing is though, he might have a Scorch, he might just be saving it. I swear to God if he has a Scorch. I just wanna get like a really high round now. I, I think I've won. I mean, there is no way he's catching up, is there? I do just want to see how high I can get. This is quite a good sort of high level round, I think. Two ground. Um, sure. You're good. You know what, Wolf? I have this rare card here. Take it. It'll be of more use to you. Thanks. You might consider challenging a man in Kertrolda village. A worthy adversary, though a mere tailor. Just as his name. God, there's so many people to Gwent. I love it. Move, everyone. I must Gwent. Get out of the way, you goddamn soldiers. Leave me. A lot of people in here, isn't there? Just chilling. Okay, so there is actually a marker too. I, I don't know if it's in here. I think it's like at the top of Gear Shoulder or something. I'm sure I can park on my way up there. I'll work it out. Maybe there's like a way I can get there. Like, you know, from within. I know you can go upstairs here. Yeah, here's the way. Because Ceres is up here when you want to find her later on. Well, depending on what ending you have. This is like the Yarl's quarters, isn't it? Uh, can I steal? I can. I can totally steal. No one's here. Okay, let's loot. Some mirrors, some candles. There's a, there's a few there's things, but there's oh god damn it. Oh, oh actually, you know what? I can sell that saddle. Oh, I didn't mean to Foreigner, steal it. What's your step? Yeah, I'm just gonna go in here and steal. It's, there's no problem for either of us. All right. I steal. You you sort of stand there. You know, it's 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 a good it's a good system. Okay, well that was fun. Right, let's go and let's go and get this marker, and then we'll go and do the Gwent of the other two lads. Just why not? I kind of feel like there's no point doing the Ceres and Hjalmar stuff right now. I've done quite a lot of other quests today. I did the Yennefer one, and I could do that as like a double part next time. As in, like you know what I mean, like both of those. How am I supposed to get over there? There is a way to get up, isn't there? Like I guess we did it before with Ceres when we rode up. I'm sure I can park on my way up there. It's totally possible. Look at it. If I can get up Bold Mountain, I can get up here. Roll! God damn it, Geralt, roll! Roll like your heart knows you must. Okay, this isn't working. It's underground, okay. I, th I, th I know there is like stuff that you can loot underground later on in a quest, but I wasn't aware of whether... I was just thought I'd check. I thought I I'm pretty sure you can't go up here. I never remember having to do this before. Yep. Okay. Let's go down. We'll go and Gwent this guy. Sigusta? I don't even know. And um, maybe we'll do a contract. I mean, I think we could probably fit a contract in, right? They're not too long. Like, obviously, as I said last time, it's just because if I go, if I end up doing like the Ceres one or Thialmar one, it could take longer than half an hour, and then I'll go over, and then the part will take me longer to do, and I, it just, I have to stick to this schedule as best I can. And if, and if I do have to do an extra long part someday, then I will. But you know, I don't really, I shouldn't go over if I can help it. Hey, Shuster. Hey, it's this guy. He cut hair. Chance you play Gwent? Oh, I. It's a great passion. Wanna play? Yes. I'm ready. Let's do this. My body is ready. Let's go. So what card did Krat give us? I, I didn't even... I keep on forgetting. E either I didn't look or I just forget. Either or. 
Okay, I'm just going to straight up open with Philippa. I think it's worked so far. Just opening really strong. Forces them to, like, go into a strong card and not sort of mess around, you know. Look at that one. What is that doing? See what I'm going to do? I'm going to put down the, um, the six and then double it just in case he can kill it or something. Oh, no, I can decode the spike. Cool. Either or. So he's going to be like 11 ahead of me or something. Yeah, I can put Siri down. It's fine. Or I could just put Roach down. Hang on, what do I need to get here? I need to get eight. I could put an eight down and then revive it. Yeah, I could do that. Well, no, I, I actually need to get um, seven, don't I? Do I, have, I, I guess eight, sure. Because I can revive it, right? Um, A lot of these cards are kind of useless, you know? Like that. I might just go into Triss. I guess I, I want to revive the Spy if he uses it. But... Oh, shit. That's fine, that's fine. I could just go into this play early on. Because he's played that now, right? I don't have to worry. So I can do this, into this, into this, into this. I think I added an extra this. It's fine. Destroy the strongest siege unit. That is literally the, like, counter to my ability. I couldn't think of anything worse. Oh, shit. I only have a 10. Oh, I totally could have scorched them. I totally could have scorched them. And now I play the waiting game. Okay. You can mess around all you want, mate. I can mess around all day. Yeah. I'm waiting for you to play that other Blue Stripes Commando, you little bitch. And then you're dead. Oh. Or I win. <laughs> he, he must have had like a like a Bravo. frost or something. A grand win. Biting frost. Nice, we won. Amazing. You suck. Sorry, that wasn't very nice. Do you sell coin cards? I don't know. You're a hairdresser, probably not. Okay. Yavin! <gasps> we got Yavin! Oh my god, do you guys remember Yavin from The Witcher 1? Oh, he is so awesome, guys. I miss Yavin. I, 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 I don't even know what's going on with him right now. Did he die? I can't remember. I, I, I remember he, like, did this whole ambush thing, and they say he died, right? No, no, he did die. I think you have said, right? Am I wrong in thinking that? What have we got here? Gwen, from Gremist. How the hell? That is kind of a weird place to get to. I, I guess I can go up from the, the graveyard or whatever. Okay, god damn, I'm so happy we've got the Yaving card. Sup, guys, I'm just gonna roll away. I don't really want to fight you all. You guys can, like, deal with this marker. You can live here. Oh, fine. God damn it. God damn it. Hang on. Guys, you know what? I'll help. I wasn't planning to, but there are a lot of drowners here, and you guys seem to be scared, so I will help. But what is a witcher gonna do if not help random strangers? Yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to get anything from this. Hang on, this is a problem. Can I hear freaking wolves? Hey, Drowner. Not not done yet. Sorry, I'll drown dead, whatever. Either or. They're the same thing, okay? I helped. You know what? Fine. I get mutagens. I never get goddamn red mutagens, but, you know, I get mutagens. Are you guys all right? Like, what are you doing here? You're just kind of watching, huh? I guess I'll kill the other one for you? Sure. Why not? No, show me what you got. Burn, drown, or burn. Back attack. Okay, I think I think that's the drowners dealt with. Are you guys cool? 
they're just kind of watching. I guess I'll run. So we have um, obviously this marker to do. Sorry, marker this quest. But then we might have finished all the Gwent and Skelliger for like the main guys. And that's always good. I don't know how close we are to getting every Gwent card. I think we're quite a bit of the way off, maybe. Um, we still have to get all the crones, obviously. There's a few of the monsters. Uh, I feel like we do we're definitely low on monster cards, you know what I mean? We have a lot of all the other cards. I can really check in the achievement section, right? Like how close I am. Oh. You must pass your knowledge on. I have to actually talk to Grammis. I should do what I please. Now leave me be. Okay, well, I actually want to talk to Gremist anyway. Be, will ye? No, I need to... Oh, fine. <laughs> Druid, I must yes? talk to Gremist. You and I need your help for this. Kind old geezer I just saw you talking to. Who was he? One of our circle. Gremist. An exceptional alchemist. But a stubborn mean ass. Well, been around sorceress is my share. Long enough to know that with great enlightenment comes even greater arrogance. But sorceress is welcome apprentices, am I right? Not Gremist. So many formula in that head. So many methods of ingesting and absorbing lethal toxins. But he'd rather take them to the grave than share. Why? Think he might share them with me? <laughs> sure. Maybe he'll make an exception. Share them with me. As likely as mistletoe sprouting from right here. We can only hope. Gremist, I actually need to talk to you about Gwent too. Maybe we can Gwent him and then he'll like us. I want to talk to you. But I do not wish to speak. Leave. You distress me. We want to play some Gwent? Oh. You seem a nice enough guy. Well, I'm not. A plan never to be. I became a druid to avoid others. To not have to deal with them. Not to smile when I don't wish to. To feign compassion when someone's travails matter less to me than a pair of birch cones. So I shall be straight. Get out of my sight. Before something, I know not what, deprives you of yours. Oh, Jesus. No, I want you to teach me alchemy. I want you to share your knowledge. Teach me alchemy. <laughs> you? My apprentice? <laughs> That's rich. While you're at it, why did you ask Uderic if he'll share Spickerog with you? I'm serious. <laughs> That's so. Don't make me laugh. I've devoted my life to alchemy. Sun, literary. Spent countless days and nights with nothing but alembics, choking on fumes, scorching my skin with acids. If you think I'll simply portray to you what I learned through years of sacrifice and toil, then you're mistaken. Deeply. Can I convince you somehow? Oh, gods. You're as bothersome as a gadfly before a storm. Hmm. The way I'm preparing to perform a rather tricky ritual. So I could use some help. Even yours. I require three favors. Do them for me, and I shall accept you as my apprentice. Well, well, there's a way after all. Get off your high horse and listen. First, you must bring me a pimpernel from the Muskogan forest. Second, I need a bottle of spirit from the old distillery on Hale Hill. Finally, convince Fridjof to help me perform the rite. He's a druid like I am. You'll find him near Blandara. I believe he's there on a matter of some import. So, what will it be? F Frit Fritjof, who's that? This Fritjof, who is he? A Vader maker, huh? You don't know the word, do you? And I pledge to make you my apprentice. A Vader maker is a druid who can manipulate the weather, stop a storm, cause hail, make lightning turn your enemy to ash. I advise to address him with the utmost respect, if you value your life. It doesn't have another name as well. It's called like a, it begins with a T or something, or an A, or it's like a t something mancer. Oh my god, I can't remember it at all. Hang on. Spirit, why do you need that? As you must know, potential apprentice. Alcohol is the base for all potions. 
Superior alcohol means a higher quality potion. This spirit has no equal. Its strength, its flavor. Unfortunately, the distillery atop Hale Hill has fallen into disrepair. We've lacked a source ever since. But you'll manage somehow, won't you? You're so confident. Why do you need a pim pimper now? Maybe I think I think I thought it was like a aeromancer or something or aeromancy like or is that what they use? Maybe like a Vader maker is like, you know, like a mage uses frost magic. Like what the wild don't use sort of frost magic, you know, like a Vader maker or whatever uses um a aeromancy or something. Is that you say it? a aero a a aero? I always it was always a weird one. I know it was a e. Uh, why did you need Pimpernel? Hmm. Pimpernel. As far as I know, it's got no use in alchemy apart from... Would you teach your grandmother to suck eggs? It's not any Pimpernel, but the one that grows in the Morskodin forest. And if the rumors are true... A creature jealously guards all the herbs growing there. Forest creature jealously guarding some secrets? Sounds familiar. I'll do it. All right, I'll do it. But this ritual you want to perform, what's that about? If ye wish to be my apprentice, you must stop asking questions. I decide what to tell you and when to do it. Now go, chop chop, before I change my mind. Oh, there is a lot to do for this quest. I always remember this one being like a long one. 24 as well. I guess we should probably do that one like at a later date. Like for now, we should probably do the lower level ones. Like, let's see. So we have, <coughs> pardon me. We have the Lord of Unvic, Iron Maiden, Possession, and Missing Persons. Okay. Okay, guys. Well, I think I'm going to stop today's Witcher part there. This has been The Witcher 3 Wilds and part 30. I've decided to stop it, I guess, a little bit short. It's literally, like, hitting two hours for me uh, now. So I'm sure I'll cut out little bits here and there, and it might be, like, an hour and 50, hour and 45 type thing. I it'll probably be around there. But the reason why is that if I go too far over, obviously, it's going to take me too long to do. And I feel like all the stuff I've got to do is going to take at least, sort of, half an hour to do each individual quest. Probably longer for, like, the Unvic one and maybe Viserys one. But we'll see. I thought I'd um, stop there anyway. Obviously, all the Yennefer stuff is going to take a bit of time because it's coming up to the Garden of Freya and stuff. So I'll leave that all for next time, and I've had a really good time today. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Anyway, be sure to like the video if you want to see this Witcher 3 series continue. As liking it just lets you know you support these sort of videos, you want to see more and you enjoy it, and you just want to see it continue. So thank you for doing that. I really, really appreciate it. Obviously, thank you to everyone that subscribed. Be sure to follow me on Twitter and also follow me on Twitch. I recently made a little thing for that. I've been doing a lot of Twitch recently, playing a lot of story games. I've been doing very long streams. Go and check it out. It's really, really fun. I'd appreciate it if more of you came on and watched me and sort of uh, chatted and stuff. I always have a nice time with you guys. But honestly, just watching the Witcher parts, watching the lore videos and stuff is really nice, so thank you for doing all of that anyway. And also, of course, be sure to join the Discord and Reddit, and as always, a big thank you to the Patreon pledges. You guys are just honestly amazing. I just want to say thank you all so much. Thank you all so much. Just, honestly, just thank you so much. It's really, really calm what you do, and I genuinely appreciate it, and I'm glad to put your names at the end of these videos. Like, I'm just, you know, it, it's just so kind. I love how it's evolved over time, the Patreon pledges, sort of, the way I've done it at the end of the videos, because I went back and watch like an old Witcher 1 part, you know, an old, it's all different, so it's very cool, but th thank you for doing it anyway, and I really, really do appreciate it, and I just want to say thank you. But anyway, guys, that's in today's Witcher 3 part. I'll be back later this week with another lore video, so be sure to stay tuned for that, and I'll see you on the next video. Have an awesome rest of the week.